Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Our Superman Legacy cast is shaping up. We're going to get some answers very soon or not so soon. Hey everyone, this is Digital Charcuterie. If you like the video, Hulk smash that like button. And if you're new to the channel, click subscribe. We do videos all the time. We are a charcuterie board of digital content. Superman Legacy is a movie that's going to hit theaters in July 2025. Rebooting the DCU, giving us a whole new universe to play in. Blue Beetle is the first character, whatever. Superman Legacy is our first movie under the new regime of DC films and Superman is going to be the first movie that we're going to get. I did a video about the casting of that. It seems things are coming up swiftly and now we're going to turn our attention to Lex Luthor and Lois Lane. They did some in-person auditions. It sounds like Nicholas Holt is out as Superman. He was originally contacted to audition for Lex Luthor before he wanted to turn the tables and try out for Clark Kent Superman and that's not working out, so now the Hollywood Reporter is suggesting that he might throw his name back in the ring for Lex Luthor. Ever since I saw him in About a Boy 20 plus years ago, I said this guy could be Lex Luthor. No, I'm just kidding. The other two are a couple of brothers and they're the Skarsgård brothers. Alexander and Bill Skarsgård for the role of Lex Luthor. This is what the Hollywood Reporter is suggesting they're also auditioning for the, the roles of the authority as well they're going to make their debut in this movie before their own film comes out uh following this one whenever that will be no direct or anything's been announced for that and then we know that they will be in, in this movie and it looks like lois lane emma mackey is down to the wire she was the only one brought back for the second round of auditions when the actors were brought in in full superman wardrobe got to wear the cape and everything she was the only one brought in. Uh, the reporter is saying that they're hearing that that is not an indication that she is the front runner, but it is hard to suggest uh, that she is not. Why would they not bring anyone else in? Scheduling maybe, but who knows? Uh, you stick around long enough, Harrison Ford gets Han Solo, right? That's how it works out. So she could be our Lois Lane. Corn Sweat could be our Superman. And a Skarsgård, our Lex Luthor. Or maybe a curveball is thrown and Nicholas Holt is coming in how do you go to that family dinner at the scars guards after you know one of you gets the role and the other one doesn't how awkward is that it's like well you could who knows but also there was one that scars guard was also up for swamp thing for james mangold also so who knows if the wires are getting crossed at the hollywood reporter or not but look their reports are coming around there are various reports circulating that were that they're going to finalize this cast this week and other reports are saying that we're going to hear about it in July, which would make sense, right? Two years out, we hear about it, they shoot in January, they cast now, get all the paperwork signed, and then maybe DC is the only nerdy group at Comic-Con for movies, and they hit us with the Superman Legacy casting, blowing the roof off of Hall H, because no one else will. This is your time to shine, DC. Let's see what you got. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And until next time, may you be the master of your own universe.